What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Uh, today we're talking about the PC port of Perfect Dark, which allows you to have 4K visuals, widescreen support, uh, any resolution you really want, which is absolutely fantastic. And um, to really kind of reiterate that we're going to just set this up. Reiterate. I can't speak English sometimes. But let's do that. So if you come down here, this is a build for Windows. This is a build for Linux. These builds are 32-bit. Okay, currently they have not converted to 64 bit. On Windows, you go here and I'll automatically download there. As you can see, I already have it set up. You are going to need a ROM, by the way. It's very easy to find. And uh, if we head in here, I rip copyright music. If we head in here, this is what the unzipped folder looks like. So you have your uh, configuration settings. This is where we're going to be changing resolution. And this is your executable. I'm going to be adding a perfect dark logo to it soon. And then this is where you put your ROM. So this is what you name your ROM. Okay. And just to let you know, this is version 1.1 of the game. And it's, uh, it's NTSC. Okay. Once you do that, you can execute this and have it start up. But I don't want to do that at the moment. Let's open up the game. Okay. So it's going to open up on my other window. But here it is. And uh, I did add an icon to it, and I'm going to show you the icon that I added to it because I really, really want to. Nice icon. Uh, let's open that up in the photos. So this is the icon that I added. As you can see, it's the same icon that's right there for Perfect Dark, which is really nice. And if we click through here, let me put on my headphones. And uh, we're going to start a new agent. We're gonna hit Q. We're gonna do ZZ. We're gonna hit Q. Correct. Jump in. Tell the mission. Agent. Accept. E should honestly be the button for select because that's what we're used to. All right. So we do have mouse controls. Okay. It works really, really well. This is interpolated. It feels like interpolation because it feels like absolute garbage. It gave me a headache after a while. So this is not real 60 FPS. You can tell because it's not smooth like real 60 FPS. So there's that. Another thing I don't like is that auto aim is enabled. So I hate auto aim. I hate head roll. And we're done. Great. So now we are shooting where we're actually shooting. Now this isn't going to require any compiling or weird setting up unless you're testing pull requests. My guess they have actions enabled. Which is fine. No one coming up or down, right? Because usually I just go and take care of all of them. Get shot in the neck. As you can see, you have perfect aim and control. So the mouse looks pretty good. I wasn't expecting that him to roll his head, but it worked. Oh, gotta hurt. Another one dead. Shoot me, you prick. There we go. He's dead. Uh, what about in here? Nobody in here? For real? Okay. I'm still getting used to the controls in a nutshell, but they do work very well. Go back up. So everyone's dead. The bodies are not disappearing, which is nice. Let's get out our fists. Thank you. We killed Lady Godiver. And now, let's head downstairs. That guy's probably dead, right? Right. Yeah. I love this new mic arm, by the way. This thing is built like a tank. I really, really want to do a video on it, but I don't know if any of you want to see the video.
No, bro, you're dead. You're dead. Whoa, he's fast. Is he up there? Let's head in. Let's go. So, I maybe want to run through another level with you guys. Okay. Super strafing still works. Intruder alert. Who are you calling an intruder? I don't want to die. You're already dead. Now getting to your um, your gadgets is pretty easy. Why'd you both go over there? So we're going to grab the shield real quick. Hit enter. And you use your uh, keyboard keys. But there is controller support, by the way. Dual shock and all that. So that's not really an issue. My guess is they probably use SDL2. If they're smart, anyway, they'll use SDL2. If not, it's really them. Do I just hit Q? Yeah, I do. I find this much easier to control than the actual N64 version. That was a perfect headshot, douchebag. Alright. Clearly I have shitty aim. Oh, that took way too long. Did I just shoot that out of your hand by accident? Now the dragon's in that room, and honestly... I think it's this room, actually. No, it's not there. Ooh. But there is some ammo. I want to go grab the dragon. Door's locked. So that's the wrong room. I liked how we, uh, I hope this is considered to be eligible for speedruns. Because that would be amazing if it was. Bring it on. I love that. Bring it on. Oh, it's the K7 Avenger. Oh, this gun is dreamy. Uh, I believe there's an access hatch over here that we could just get up real easy and we don't have to really do anything with. If I remember correctly, which I did. Oh, it's Thank you. Yeah, you press space and you also end up shooting around. Uh, I would have been streaming this last night, but unfortunately there's something broken um, with uh, OBS where I can't stream to YouTube for some reason. I don't know what it is. Only OBS. But it is what it is. We're recording an AV1, once again, because 4070 and all that. Alright, let's get out of here. Look at all the blood. No. No. A7 Avenger always gets his ban. Good timing, too, on this little guy. Go through here. So I have played past the Institute all the way to Chicago. I found no bugs, no visual issues yet. So the game's looking good. Flatline. Flatline. Did I flatline this one? I did.
All right, hit enter. Grab the data uplink. You press enter to exit. And left mouse button to initiate. Right mouse button is of course to aim. Figured I go through this. K7 Avenger. Watch, Warner's rookie. I think he's dead. I don't believe it. You hear this guy? This is why I love the K7. It's way better than the dragon. It's literally a two hit shot for any like technological thing. All right, we're going to do one last level. And do that shit up. Thank you for being a Patreon. Not a Patreon, uh, patriotic and protecting your company and being loyal. I see you too. Let's turn this off. Is it coming? Is it? It is. Hello, Dr. Carol. You can stay here. Up we go. I'm going to try to remember this one correctly, but I do need to get a shotgun. Okay. First things first. Shield. Second thing second. Shotgun. Shotgun should be around this corner. Thank you. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Come on. And up we go. Dr. Carroll should be coming up soon. Yeah, he's right there. No. This is a door. One of my bullets went through her head. Alright. So it's going to be very, very bright, but I always do this. Don't hate me. We meet again, girl. You've become quite an annoyance. <laughs> Can't leave any bodyguard in the family. And we are done. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is the PC port of Perfect Dark at the moment in time.
builds probably will be updated with fixes and multiple different things corrected and done so i will leave the github in the description below you guys can check that out and i'll see you guys next time i will be covering its progress as much as possible okay thanks for watching bye bye